I will provide you some brief information today about sensor mounting for the PDA DLT system and in order to do the sensor mounting properly you first need to drill holes in the concrete pile which you are going to test. Uh, I have a dummy pile today and normally the sensors are being mounted uh, roughly 1.5 up to 2 times the diameters from the pile head. First you have to align the drilling template to the pile and then you use a standard concrete drill in order to drill the first hole for your sensor mounting. Uh, my pile is already prepared and after drilling the holes you use a blower in order to clean the dust from the holes in order to make sure the plugs have optimum grip in the concrete pile. A hammering tool is being used in order to spread the plugs properly in the concrete so you have to hammer it and then after hammering the plugs need to be flat with the concrete surface before mounting the sensors. The sensors are being supplied in a red transport bracket and before mounting the sensor to the pile you have to remove this bracket. Remember not to drop the conical washers into the sand. The short bolt is being used for the upper part of the sensor and always use one pair of the washers uh, between the bolt and the sensor. Never use them in this way. Always use them uh, as a pair like this uh, because if the holes are not drilled 100% uh, perpendicular in the concrete this gives you the uh, flexibility to still mount your sensor properly. First a short bolt, tighten them uh, hand tight so there is no pre-stress on your sensor, on your strain element. Then the larger screw which is long enough to bridge the distance from the sensor housing. And last, tighten the bolts firmly with the supplied allen key. Then the lower bolt and in order to check the mounting quality in the next video I will show you the monitoring offset. Take care and see you next time.